So the first thing that I want to look at is this Ace of Clubs, Four of Clubs on a 3-4 King board with all hearts. And the, the situation, we have a 21-17-6 uh, regular who calls on the button. There is a 50 big blind stack, uh, kind of a weaker player in the blinds. And the villain folds to about 50% of C-bets. So our hand is fairly weak and there are very few barrel cards as we'll get into. Uh, the flop texture uh, includes a high card, the king, and not many draws. Uh, this is very much one of those hands where he either has a hand or, um, there. I mean, there's the flush draw, uh, but most of the hands that he's going to have are just not going to be that crazy about the flush draw. Um, now, our opponent's range, since he's on the button, he is going to be uh, looser, and the presence of the weaker player in the blinds is also going to cause him to be looser. And because of that, I gave him uh, this kind of a range of... Uh, we talked about the uh, the continuation ranges. Um, I give him the average range, and I added uh, the king, jack, and ace, jack uh, offsuit uh, to that range uh, because of the presence of the fish. So now, how? Uh, let's look at the, our general thought process here. Get that slide up. Here we go. So, uh, th did we connect with the flop? And the answer is yes. How strongly? Very weakly. Uh, what range will villain continue with? And that is the, uh, the million-dollar question. So let's bring up um, the range we assign in preflop, 152 combos. We know he's not going to fold to top pair or better, and he's going to have that about 30% of the time. So 46 combos of top pair plus. In addition to that, he is going to have a uh, nut flush draw, He's going to have six combos of the nut flush draw. And we know he's going to continue with that. And he's going to, let's say he's not going to fold uh, any kind of middle pair that includes hearts. So he's going to continue with uh, fives, sixes, sevens, uh, eights, nines, tens, jacks uh, with hearts. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So seven times three combos of pair plus flush draw. Uh, we're gonna say he's gonna peel with them at least once, uh, which is going to be 21 combinations. And um, he's going to probably call with a hand like ace queen uh, with the queen of hearts. So that's going to be uh, two more combos. Uh, of ace queen with queen of hearts. So we have a total of 75 combinations that he continues with, uh, and appropriately, looks like he's going to be folding about 50% of the time. So if he's going to be folding about 50% of the time, um, and is our bet going to be plus EV? So you can probably bet like half the pot here and be one and done. Um, the problem is if he does call, then we're just shutting down on anything that's not a four. Um, we probably will bet an ace again, but I think everything else we are going to be, well, we can bet, we can bet a queen too. Uh, so let's, let's write that down. So any four, uh, any... Uh, any ace, and I might or might not bet a queen. But in general, I would say this is just a very much like a one and done scenario in this situation.